it's a pain in the neck. It can be because you have to make sure that you file it in on time. If you don't, you have to uh, do some amending with the labor department. Then you'd have to uh, make sure that the IRS gets it because that IRS, for whatever reason, they're late with a lot of notice. But if you do not file F-150-500, it seems like they know instantaneously. And they will send you out the form with a penalty. In the past, I've seen that when you eventually do file the form 5500, they will reverse the penalty. But with everything going on, I just would not take the chance in 2023 um, to file late if you decided that you were going to move forward and move with the full, the solo 401k. Um, and what's uh, really good with both of these options, whether you go SEP or solo 401k, is that because of the Secure 2.0 Act, there are additional tax incentives for just uh, setting up a retirement period. 